I'm Paul Roar. I'm Dwight Elizabeth. And we're from Benton, Kentucky. Uh, we're opening a gym in Benton and wanted to uh, explore different equipment, fitness equipment. We'd heard of Prime. I'd seen, uh, I follow a lot of John Meadows uh, programming and saw some of his programs got Prime fitness equipment in there. Thought it looked neat, looked into it. They have an interesting cam system. So I thought, eh, that might be something pretty cool to put in our gym. Let's go ahead and try it out. So called Mike, uh, talked to him on the phone, said, hey, what about flying up and taking a look at this stuff and seeing if it's something that we want to put in our gym? Because, yeah, yeah, I got on a flight, came up to Franklin, Pennsylvania, and uh, came over to the Prime uh, showroom to try out some equipment. Pretty blown away, really. By, Camp system. Yeah, what we looked at and everything. Tried out a lot of different equipment up here. Uh, both of us have ailments. I have problems from competing in powerlifting. I uh, competed for almost six years. So my joints aren't exactly great. I'm 42 years old, so that makes a difference. Uh, my knees are kind of shot a little bit. Uh, I have a shoulder issue. So I wanted to kind of see how uh, the cam system, the plate loaded stuff, hitting different, hitting the muscle group a different way, kind of, you know, felt to our bodies. And um, I'm just getting into bodybuilding and changing out the cams, uh, helping you hit, especially in your legs, the muscles in a different way, let you be able to squeeze where maybe I couldn't get the weight to before. Um, so that'll be pretty beneficial for trying to lean out and sculpt those muscles, so. Yeah, I, that's, that's what I was blown away most by, is that you can move the cam system to target like when you're when you're finishing off a set and to really squeeze out some extra reps that you normally wouldn't get off of a machine or play loaded machine or even a, even a bar just moving the weight and you can move that cam to like really hit the top end of the muscle group and just you know bear it out i mean to absolute failure and just completely kill yourself which is great and if you're trying to trying to build and grow and get stronger that's really what you want so yeah, and I haven't been able to press in a few months. I've hurt part of my shoulder. And being able to change out the cams, um, I can press because it hurts up at the bottom, but I can still get the good squeeze at the top. Um, so that was really refreshing. Yeah, the shoulder press is pretty, pretty amazing for you to be able to use that. And, and moving around the cam system on that, just to see if it affected your shoulder in any way, what you were doing. And it didn't, like any, any of the places that we moved it to, whether it was low end or the top end, you know, felt good to you, didn't hurt at all. And um, I'm not very coordinated with dumbbells, so doing the bicep machine really yeah, helped perfect. with the squeeze. Like, I felt like I knew what I was doing instead of just flailing weights around. Um, so that was nice. Yeah, and, and talking about my knees, um, I really want, was interested to see how the leg extension would work for my knees. and. I did the same thing that Elizabeth did with the cam on the leg extension and moved it around, played with it to see if it bothered my knees. Felt good on every setting. I was able to do uh, the setting that really hit the top end of it and put some heavy weight on there just to see if it bothered my knees and it felt great the whole time, which is awesome because I haven't been able to do leg extensions on regular equipment or selectorized equipment in a long time because it absolutely kills my knees and this felt fantastic so yeah, it was really great uh the pullover that i was really excited about coming up here because i'd used an old nautilus pullover years ago um hadn't had anything in any gyms close to us since then nobody has that stuff anymore so i was pretty pumped to see that that was on prime's website and I, I even made her try because I was so excited about Talked it. Talked about it for days. Yeah, okay. talk about it. And, and when I found out that Prime had one of those, I was like, I, I gotta go just to try this thing out and, and see. And I'm really blown away by it. It was fantastic. It was all that I wanted it to be. It definitely um, hits your legs in a better way than dumbbell pull. Oh, it's great. And, and a variation that, that Corey and I, when we're training, <clears throat> we do uh, band around a dumbbell and do dumbbell banded pullovers with somebody pulling behind you. So that variation really gets a good squeeze at the top where you normally lose all your tension right there. So you get a good stretch at the bottom, get a good squeeze at the top, and the pullover 
mimics that completely, especially when you can utilize the cam in there and be able to really hit at the bottom or you know hit some heavy weight at the top end. It's just pretty great. Yeah, really like it. So coming up here and trying all this equipment out, definitely worth it. Uh, when I talked to Mike on the phone, he said you really have to try this stuff to understand how you know how it really works. And and I was like, yeah, and I've tried fitness equipment and I've I've been training for a long time. I really know this stuff, but man, coming up here, using the equipment, getting on it, seeing how everything feels, really blown away. Like it was. It was a wonderful learning experience. Just to, yeah, it was awesome. Yeah, figure out how to hit different muscles, and it's. I mean, I'm kind of sad to leave. Yeah, I, and and I think if it was up to her, she would put all this in our Every gym if we could. Yeah, because it was it was really great to use. Um, definitely going to be putting this stuff and yeah in the lines then and if anybody is curious about prime fitness i think that you definitely need to make the trip check it out come up here use this stuff see how it feels because i you're like us and you're definitely gonna be going away as we were for sure